Hello people of the world. Good morning. No, it's good night. Hello people of the world. Good night. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, it's going to be a vlog and you don't have any choice but to be with me tonight. Currently fixing my makeup room because it is once again a mess while watching TFC. So I'm gonna apply some mask because my skin needs some hydrating, some brightening, something to make it look more important. And I just wanna tell you guys how much I love this mask right here. This is from Global Beauty Care and this is their glowing metallic gold plus Manuka Honey Royal Jelly Wash Off Face Mask. And this brightens your skin, makes it so smooth and soft and makes it feel and look important after using it. In just 15 minutes but i want to try this as well i forgot what month this came in i want to try this out this is the wonder beauty baggage claim gold eye masks my eyes needs lots of rescuing let's see if this thing works look at my eyes very carefully and remember how it looks right now so we can see if this thing is effective or not it smells really good so it says to leave it for 10 to 15 minutes so the same as the mask so we're gonna apply this mask around our face and this is so cheap and you get so much product i'm gonna link it down below so you guys can go ahead and check them out look how goldy and just expensive looking it is i'm currently living for the current weather that we have right now in louisiana fall season is here and the weather is so nice okay so that's it look at it i look so gold i feel so expensive <laughs> i'm gonna show you guys an ice cream that i discovered from hagen das i haven't tried it because i've been saving it for this vlog Ooh, look at that this is my macarons right here i love to put it in the freezer because it tastes so much better this is the ice cream they got the white and milk chocolate they also have the lemon and raspberry and coffee and vanilla let's try this right here i freaked out when i saw this at target because it's crispy three old layers so it's kind of like trifle something like that and if you haven't tried hagen dust ice cream they're really good okay so let's see how this looks like Ooh, look at that can you see the layers let's try cheers it tastes so good it's not sweet this flavor right here tastes just like my raspberry trifle it's so freaking good oh my gosh but look at the layers there's also a crunch so i really like it look at that see these white specks right here i don't know if you can see that's like a white chocolate layer can you hear it it's very thin so it's really really good and i love the layer of raspberry as well mm. Since it is so good, let's go ahead and try these other two. So we're gonna try this one. This is the Belgian chocolate white and milk chocolate ice cream. So the lemon and raspberry a while ago, the layer of that was white chocolate and raspberry sauce. This one is a Belgian chocolate. And fighting. Hagen Das, please sponsor me. <laughs> Ooh. Do you see what I see? Cheers. This is so divine. Mm. You see the layers of Belgian chocolate, the white chocolate ice cream, and the milk chocolate ice cream. And look at those beautiful layers. Look at that. Mm. For all my Filipino peeps, it tastes like Milo, but in a very expensive and important way. Last but not the least is this one right here. This is a Belgian chocolate coffee and vanilla. Ooh. Oh, look at that. Cheers. Did you see the layers? Look at that this one i don't know if you can tell but you can see right here that it's kind of like watery frozen 
It almost feels like they put like a frozen coffee layer on it and I love it about that. I don't know why. That just gives it a more of a texture. Look at it fell. And I don't know about you, but if you're a Filipino, you'd understand this. Whenever we would have our fridge on, because we barely turn on our fridge in a year, we only turn it on during Christmas, New Year, and one birthday celebration. Maximum is five times a year that we turn on our fridge because electricity bill is not cute. Every time we turn that on, I would always make myself a coffee and I would always put it in the fridge and let it sit in the freezer for a good amount of time until it's kind of like frozen -y ice. And I love that so much. I used to do the same thing with Milo. So if you're a Filipino, I don't know if that's a Filipino kid thing, but I used to do that all the time when I was a kid. So <laughs> go get your hands on this trio ice cream from Hagen Das. It's really, really good. And if you know me, I hate vanilla, but that actually the vanilla flavor of it adds the aspect about it that it tastes like a coffee from Starbucks. So I'm gonna take this off because it's been 15 minutes. We're gonna go in the bathroom. Do you see any difference? So what I do now is this is usually the time when I'm gonna check my Instagram, reply to DMs, reply to comments, check my emails, reply to them. Um, update on my lips. My lips has been okay but I did notice that there are certain lipsticks now that I cannot use and sadly I cannot use any of the balm liquid lipstick matte liquid lipsticks because right when i apply it on my lips my lips just feel so tingly it irritates my lips the moment it touches my lips so i cannot use any the balm liquid lipsticks anymore let me show you one it seemed like it's a really good lipstick though like it lasts long so i was really sad about that so far this is the only formula that my lips react in a negative way and this is pretty expensive. Also, this MAC Studio Fix 24 Hour Smooth Wear Concealer, they released this recently. And do not get this. Do not get this. It's a very thin, lightweight formula. It covers a good amount and kind of like silkyish actually on your skin. But the moment you apply this and blend it, two seconds, you're gonna start creasing. So bad it's not even cute so don't get that okay so let's take this mask off because it's been 10 minutes <sighs> this particular mask right here the glow boosting grapefruit right when you put it on your skin you're gonna start to feel like a tingling sensation and do not freak out it's actually normal and that's just signaling you that the mask is working Wow, I look so important now. I look so glowy, so bright, so cute. Look at me. Mom, you're my number one, 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 one. Oh, so good. 
I'm gonna tell you guys a little story, okay? I got pregnant with Olivia. I, for some reason, one of the pregnancy effects to me is that I do not like wetting my head. I would only wash my face and wash my body. I would leave my head and my hair dry. I just don't like getting it wet. I feel nauseous, I feel dizzy, I feel groggy whenever I wet my hair. So, of course, a part of that is my dandruff started to get pretty, uh, pretty intense. And so I really didn't mind because, you know, I had all the excuses in the world because I'm pregnant and you do not lecture a pregnant woman and so winter came and during winter my dandruff is just horrible and there's just nothing I can do but when spring hits and summer comes my dandruff just magically it just goes away on its own but after my pregnancy when I tell you ever since I got pregnant and ever since I gave birth and up to now I still have dandruff all over my head like do you see that and I cannot get rid of it. I'm trying to use some tea tree herbal shampoos. Avoid using other shampoos. And so far, it's been actually effective. Look at that. I don't know if you can see. Uh, see, look at that. It's like snowing. I know some people get disgusted by this, but dude, it's just dandruff. Like, not that bad. I tried using apple cider with aloe vera. It's been helping. And I don't wash my hair as well using hot water. I use it with cold water. My face as well because hot water destroys our skin. I don't know if you guys know that. By the way, thank you guys so much for the very nice response for my last video which was the review of the Who Wore It Better? Maybelline Fit Me or Maybelline Superstay. I really, really am proud of myself with that video. Like. I did such a good job with that. Whenever I go to Instagram and to YouTube, like the best drugstore concealer of all time. And I don't know, I'm having a hard time trying to love this because every time I buy my shade, it's always pink undertone. And everything seems like pink undertone. So help me choose my shade. <laughs> So this is the first Revolution Concealer and Define that I got for myself and I was so bummed because I'm like this has such a pink tone so I go to Ulta and um, buy me another one and I'm like thinking oh this is perfect this is it this is my shade and I come here <laughs> they're the same freaking color <laughs> I'm gonna have to return these because this is a waste of money oh and by the way mm, i got this from etsy this shop at etsy called heart the sparkle and oh my gosh she has the most beautiful pop socket cap in the entire world from swarovski crystal to stones she does customize as well go ahead and make sure to check her out i'm gonna leave her link down below for that so this one right here is a swarovski i think this is gold or rose gold she's only selling the cap so if you buy yourself a normal pop socket from target or wherever you can get it you can actually press one the sides and it'll come off so what she sells is the cap. When I tell you, she creates the most beautiful pop socket caps in the entire world. The quality is so good. It is well made and she makes it with her own hands, okay? She puts those crystals in there one by one and she is so talented i love her so much and this case i got this from cases la mode it's a really good quality case although they bombard you with emails after you sign up for them if you are noticing <laughs> my camera has a rubber band in it because oh my goodness it is broken i don't know if you can see that it is moving it is missing a screw this screw is freaking hard to find canon doesn't provide that because of course they want you to buy another new camera more money for them and my husband found one on ebay and it's freaking expensive anyway i'm almost out of battery so i'm gonna end the vlog right here right now so yeah thank you guys again so much for watching please uh, click thumbs up if you did like this video and comment down below what you think subscribe if you haven't already and mama with a cute ass important skin i'll see you on her next video bye